The Diocese of Ijesa North Church of Nigeria, Anglican Communion has carpeted the federal government over the way it was handling criminal cases and serial attacks by the Boko Haram sects and herdsmen in the country. The diocese expressed the disappointment in a communique of the first session of the Third Synod with the theme, Lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, held at the Cathedral Church of St. Matthew, Ajebu Ajessa, Osun State. It urged the government to be more proactive in protecting the citizenry, as a lot of innocent persons have lost their lives as a result of the activities of herdsmen and Boko Haram members. The communique signed by the diocesan bishop, Right Reverend, Dr. Isaac Oluyamo and diocesan registrar, Adeleke Agbola, also condemned the plan by the federal government to establish cattle colonies. According to the church, cattle rearing is strictly a private business and that the operators should buy land and establish their ranch with their own money. The Synod, however, commended the Osun state government for its massive infrastructural outplays, despite its lean resources. Also read, Igbo Muslims seek support on propagation of Islam in Southeast The Communion appealed to Governor Ralph Arag Basola to pay the full salaries of civil servants and pensioners before the expiration of his tenure later in the year. The Synod appealed to the Independent National Electoral Commission INEC, to conduct a free and fair election in the upcoming governorship poll in Osun State, while also urging politicians to conduct themselves in a civilized manner and avoid thuggery and gasterism. It, however, condemned the attitude of some Nigerians who were fun of acquiring wealth and properties for themselves for earthly pleasure without focus, as well as reaffirmed its commitment to evangelism with focus, on preparing all its parishioners for the second coming of Jesus Christ. The Synod enjoined all Christians to give generously to God's work, including their talents, treasure and time since their reward was great in heaven and on earth.